Behind me is the largest composite show in the world. It's the Czech World in its 2017 edition. This event has been running for nearly 20 years now and it's bigger than ever. 65,000 square meters of composites from all angles of the business, 1,300 exhibitors and nearly 40,000 visitors from all over the world. So why would anybody be interested in composites? Well, composites have really become a part of our everyday lives and it is difficult to imagine life without them. They enable so many of the products we use today. In transportation, for example, composites have played a significant role already for a long time. They can be found in pretty much every airliner today. They are becoming more and more common in road vehicles like cars or buses, also in trains. A lot of the high-end sports equipment today is a composite product. If you just take a look at the ice hockey sticks, the golf clubs, bicycles or skis, all of which are featured on this fair. So composites offer many benefits like strength, lightweight, corrosion resistance, design flexibility and durability. And all of this translates into better sustainability through better fuel efficiency and longer life cycles. So the market is certainly generating more demand from that side as well. This year the Jack World is putting more focus on its end users and there is an increasing evidence to show that composites are reaching mass production readiness. Software and digitality plays a much bigger role than before, obviously, like in so many other industries. So the sector is growing up from being a small series application and it's well on its way to mass production. To take a look on how Covestro is pushing boundaries in composites, check out Covestro's playlist on YouTube. But what does GEC, you know GEC, actually stand for? Surely the C stands for composites, so we asked a lot of people at the fair to give their thought on that. J, I, I don't know, but I could think a uh, European conference. Um, J, sorry. What does GEC actually stand for? The simple one, C probably stands for composites. Um, just expensive composites. Um, do you know what JEC stands for? That's a very, very good question. I wouldn't have any clue what it stands for. That's a good, uh, a good question. I think uh, I remember that it was a... Uh, the C means composite, I'm quite sure. Okay. Uh, the other one uh, I forgot. Okay. E m might be for exhibition and C for composites. Um, so uh, this is what I think. Do you know what JEC stands for? <laughs> Absolutely not, no. I don't know. I don't know it, no. We decided to get to the bottom of this and just ask the organizers. Uh, the letter uh, JEC, J-E-C, as uh, some uh, people say, but we can say also JEC, JEC group, means uh, Journée Européenne des Composites. So it was the French word meaning uh, 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 days for composites uh, solution. You, you talked yesterday at the Innovation Awards, Lily, but about where the industry is going. If you think about the next 20 years, uh, what are your expectations for the for, for the Jack and, and for the composite business? For the composite business and, and for Jack, of course, uh, we expect a, a great change because uh, we have been for the last 70 years a small uh, niche industry, as we can say, but now with uh, new machines, equipment, 3D manufacturing, robots, we can uh, deliver large series for aerospace, for automobile. So that's the main trend. The main trend is to be able uh, to uh, produce um, uh, large series. And uh, if we succeed in delivering this large series, Maybe uh, the, the composite industry uh, will be no more a niche sector, but a real full-fledged industry. And we're all certainly looking forward to that. What would be your greetings to the Jack 2018? Uh, any greetings to, 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 the, to the next year? Well, we have uh, a double-digit growth as uh, well for the Jack Group, the company, and for the show but uh, nearly all our events in the world are very successful. But for Jack World 18, I uh, wish a double digit growth again. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much.